Okay, these questions are a lot. Who wants to pick? Eh? Are you going to pick? Please, is Sony a TV on YouTube yours? No. Hell no, it's not her YouTube. It's not her own. <laughs> Introduction. <laughs> Mr. My laptop is off. Off. Take it quickly. <laughs> Go ahead. Hey, Mr. Map, press one thing. <laughs> but I do it like this as if she's knocking. Go, 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 go. Hi, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back to my channel. You guys almost. No, it's not even almost. They crucified me. They've been disturbing that I should. Bring Sonia, bring Sonia. Uwanu, I've given you Sonia. People ask your questions in Sonia's um, Instagram account. Yeah. And we are here to answer some because. Jesus Christ. <laughs> See, guys, what's up now? You want to finish wow. like wow. the questions? Jesus. Wow. Ah, what happened? People are nosy. People are too nosy. <laughs> you don't trick on everybody's business. Questions are too much. No, no, no. Like one person is asking like 10, 20 questions. Leave some questions for other people now. Like, now leave you. So this is that if I let me answer all the questions, you know, I'm like days. So that we will sleep here. <laughs> we sleep and wake up. No, just bring me some. I go and bring my trash. <laughs> now we'll not go. Um, hey, this is just a distraction. Guys, to to this people know what just happened. Please never pause this video. She said I'm leaking to the team. But you are not. People should be honest. You know. No, but even to myself, the fact that I am, like, I know I lost some weight. But I had to do it. Like, there's a, a role I finished that I needed That's to true. lose weight. Yes, that was so hard. I be want to give her flesh. <laughs> do you want to? Guys, please, let's not blame Mr. Ma. I actually lost it here. But it's just for a role. So that's just what happened. And hey, please, can you hear me? What did I do to the people? The questions you guys were asking, oh my goodness, what happened now? Is that how much you want to know things about me? Okay, um, I want to tell you people that you have power, like the kind of power you guys have. It's, it's just, I don't know how to describe it, because to bring me on this hot seat, my brothers and Please, sisters. don't bring her, let me call her shit, because people will not understand. How many weeks now have we been... Today, tomorrow, we've been shifting dates. So you're shopping tomorrow. Mm -hmm. That is why. <laughs> don't worry, by the time this video is up, if I don't grab the they don't go know. Before people will go to the airport and wait for So you're shopping tomorrow, and this is this is 7 p.m. It's just this night that we have to shoot this content. Because your favorite rights has been giving me headache <laughs> and neck, it's just body pain. But finally, thank okay. God. We brought her here in I'm one here. piece. <laughs> so, guys, um, I think we should go into Let's... the question. Hmm. We still have a long way. Mm. Hey! And the questions are plenty. Go. See, let, let me see. Let me see. Um, no. There's a particular question that I saw, like. You want to answer first? Yes. That's. Um, wait, wait, hold on. Where is it? Let me see. Have you at home? What, what's your bad habit? Okay. Oh, yeah, question. No, this particular question. Which How one? old are you? Are you done asking this? You know, no, Wait. no, please. That's the first question. I'm okay, asking. let me ask you. Uh -huh. First person is asking. She's saying, Sonia, how old are you? Mm -hmm. Please. Who are you? I'm telling you. Plenty of people ask this question. Uh -huh. Actually, a lot. Please, me, I want to ask you for this question too. What do you want to do with my age? Eh? YouTube family. <laughs> eh? Oh man, pretty or bad. What do you want to do with my age? Like, but this question of how old are you? It's not anything. I don't just like telling my age. That's just it. And people have to respect it. And even my sisters, they know when you ask me about my age, I'm not just going to answer that question. I don't like telling my age. I know it's not a big deal, but I don't just like it. Mm -hmm. I just hope this answer. And then, it's over on YouTube, sometimes I don't see Tina Rachi celebrate her 30th birthday. Like. Okay. But let me set the record straight here. I'm not even up to 30. That's the only thing I'm saying. Not yet. I'm not up to 30. Sonia, we should do 
Which, me, I want to do big 30 bed day. Third floor. Let's call it. Is it third floor? <laughs> we on the third floor. We to do yeah, 30. No, but if you want to, it's not. I will throw you a 30 bed day. You throw me. Well, I'm not expecting no. This is the way you are up to. Okay. I'll throw you yeah. a Yeah. So I don't like saying my. I don't like telling my age, but I'm not up to 30. I think that's where I'll just leave it. Okay. That's the first question. Question. Yeah. Question number one. Okay. Um. Someone said, someone is asking, mm -hmm. Sonia, do you have a celebrity crush? If yes, who? <laughs> okay. okay, I actually do have a celebrity crush, but he's not like a very popular, popular person. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you remember, Miracle, Big Brother Miracle. Hey, it's true! Yeah, I like that guy. Do you know? Yes, do you yes. Know? Uh -huh. <laughs> Miracle, what's that? What's it? Miracle Imokwe or something. That's they will know your crush son, you to fear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Miracle hey. UK. The guy like he won Big Brother twenty is it twenty eighteen or also? I don't know the year, but I know I that don't he won. Know, but we just the pilot. Him. Yes, the pilot. Huh? I'm still crushing on him. Miracle, if you by any chance in this video, just know you have a crush. Because I'm so huh? shy saying this still, but, hey. but that's what it is. I just like how so many years crush I, now. Uh -huh. she more. Yeah, I just huh? he's, he's too fine. Like the, the guy is too fine and he's too focused for so like for a guy that is that fine, it's rare to see a focused and handsome guy like that. So that, that is that. So this person is asking, Sonia, please, what is your greatest fear in life? Oh, wow. My greatest fear in life. Okay. Truth is, I have... Like, okay, my greatest fear in life is not living my purpose. Because... I feel like I feel nobody was created by mistake. There's always a reason God created someone like a hair, and it's just for you and you alone. So my fear is not being able to live the purpose which God created me. That's my greatest fear in life. Why are you shaking your head like the pastor? <laughs> like <a cow>. hey. <laughs> yeah, so that's my greatest fear in life. Oh, this person is asking, are you an art student or science student back in school? Uh, science. science. Yes, I went science in school. Yeah, but you see now, art has taken over. As in a... You got the glory. Please tell them the kind of science. What do you mean the kind of science? The kind of science now, nah. agriculture. Uh, yeah, I did agricultural science, yeah. Let me just if we want to nice to have a pooch. <laughs> With yeah. plenty chicken. I still like to. I still love to have. I miss that time. I still love to have a farm. Yeah, I want to have a farm. That one when you be running away from there. <laughs> so yeah. Okay, so this person is asking, are you a shy type? Am I a shy type? Slightly. <laughs> I'm shy, you. But when I hear rolling action, the shyness disappears. Yeah, so that's the kind of I'm not shy. Shy. <laughs> Somebody say, why are you so shy? Still the same. Hey, person. I've answered that. Mm. This mm. person is asking, which of your siblings are you closer to? Mm -hmm. Is my phone ringing? Uh, I think it's my phone. Do you want to answer that? Mm -hmm. You just leave it. Okay. Um, did you? Did, honestly, why pointing? Your <laughs> but. This is that I think over time, but eh, me and you, we, used, we used to be very, but very close. Love me My friend, go and sit down first. I think we are still close. Like, uh, I'm, I'm close to all my sisters, but this, one, lie. But this girl is one person that if I'm entering rat hole, this one can follow me. She will find the way. They know how she will follow you. They say, <laughs> Who are you closest? Why, when they answer this question, why? she's closest to Chinay now. She used to be close, close yeah, to, to me. To you. But, yeah, I just I used to be very now, very close. No, I think what happened is just because of the work. Shina and I were always true. like together because then if you if you notice, she was even complaining that it's always me and you that have pictures that me and her we don't it's have pictures. Yeah. So I just and I well while we're still in school, you and I used to be very close because we're always like um together. Yes, we're always together with each other. But then Chichi was not around. But now Chine and I were working together most of the time we're on set. So I think it's just normal that. I'm closer to China so than because I am I'm not seeing film. But we're still close. But it's okay, not like I'm it's just to seeing film. Let me know if there will be closure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But it's only we get princess out of the <laughs> Okay. 
there's one question I, I saw now, but mm -hmm. I'm going to skip it and answer it. Ask it later. Why are you skipping? Okay, this person is asking, how do you manage critics that come along with your profession? Critics? Yeah. Mm, truth is, I'm open to criticism. That's the truth. Because sometimes I feel... Um, you can draw a positive um, you can get positive things from um, critics because you can say something to me now that maybe it's something I'm actually battling with or I've been telling myself or maybe I've not been able to like say okay this is really what it is but if someone else points it out I'll be like okay okay I think I see this thing better now if it's something I feel I have to work on I'll just work on it but if it's something I feel is not necessary like this person is just talking for talking sake then I'll just leave it but critics is yeah criticism is welcome okay yeah I will go to the next question now. yeah okay this person is asking would you attempt having a haircut like IG mm -hmm. why <laughs> please okay mm. <clears throat> for truth first of all i'm not really a very stylish person to say okay let me try this style or try to play with am i stylish uh, you, at least you try you play with your hair and it actually looks really nice on her Thank but you. me my hair does not grow fast though guys so if i cut my hair like this girl it take years for the hair to grow but i can only do that on the only reason that can make me cut my hair is moving. moving. I yeah, I can go all out like that. Can do anything for <laughs> film. So, the film. Yeah, if it requires I have to cut my hair, I'll do it. That's the only time I'll cut my hair. Okay. Yeah. Your mama doesn't reply DMs. Why? What did you send to me? That's Say... the first question. Why? Truth is, like sometimes, yes, I know I'm not um um I'm not always on social media like Instagram and all of that, but when I open my Instagram and I check DMs, if it's something very important, I'm going to reply. Mm -hmm. But if you come to my DM and you're like, hi, hi, like, so then I open, somebody will send like 10 hi. What am I supposed to say when you send 10 hi? Hello, are there, what next? But if you send me a DM and you're direct to the point, hi, Sonia, this is this, that, that, that. Or even if, because I don't know, some people can attest to the fact that I, you can say hi, I love your movies. I'll be like, thank you. I do that. Yeah. But if you come to my gym and you're like, hi, hi, hi. I don't have a reply for hi. Sorry. So what are you trying to say? Hi, I love your movies. Thank you. <clears throat> if I see that, <clears throat> thank you. For those of you that have been sending hi since 2012. Change it. Change it. <laughs> yeah. Change. And also, also, sometimes the DMs are just too much. And I might not be able to get to all of them. That's another thing. Yeah. It's true, sure. but I'll try my best. Mm. Okay, this person is asking, are you the kind, are you the kind of overprotective big sister, and they want to take blame for your sisters? No, every man I'm with don't care to you. I don't take blame for anybody. <laughs> I know they even take blame for you. <laughs> I don't take blame for anybody. If you do something, you face it. I can only judge. What kind of why would I take blame? But finally, we don't even put any. No, we we'll do something. We you take we responsibility. Yeah, you take responsibility for it. It's not. Who is taking blame? Wait, for what the, what the take blame for? Is it? Yeah, this one. Okay, this person. This person mm. is asking. In movies, which role did you enjoy playing? Mm. Because I see you most time playing a role of a tomboy. <laughs> I'm telling you. Uh, is that really a role I don't enjoy playing? Okay, truth, recently, uh, honestly, recently, I've just been like, I want the village girl roles more. Before, I didn't want it, but now I'm running away from glamour, glamour because of makeup. It's just too much. Like when you have to apply powder, like foundation, do the whole makeup thing, and then you have to like keep doing touch up, touch up, you no. Know? So I would rather do the village girl where I have my bare face and eh, it's entering the face, fresh air that mm. But the village girl sun used to be too much. Too. Eh, at least use your sunscreen. I better go. I'd not say people should not give me glamour rose. For one producer, I watch it and say she likes village girl. Let's kill her with it. Please, village girl rose. I'll reject And the abroad, <laughs> abroad movies. Please. I'll reject We have our screen. international passport ready. Me as PA. <laughs> ha! 
I'm coming with her. Yeah. But this person, have I said, have I said this was the biggest thing? Yeah, I think some of the mm. questions were repeated. Okay. okay. Okay, this person is asking. Wow. Okay. If there is one thing you would change about yourself, what mm. would it be? From Uganda. This person is from Uganda. I had a lot of Uganda before. I hope you're doing good. If I'm to change one thing, what about myself? Yes. What would that be? Nothing. Absolutely. Because I think God did not make mistake when He was creating me, so there's yeah, no need to change anything. He made me perfect in His own image and likeness. So what is there to there change? You. <laughs> You're beautiful, girl. So there's nothing to change, guys. Nothing at all. Everything is perfect. Okay. So. Okay, um, someone is asking, hmm. what keeps you going in the industry and what's your advice for upcoming actors? Mm. What keeps me going in the industry is passion for the job because <clears throat> truth is, filmmaking is not an easy, easy job, trust me. It takes patience, it takes tolerance and it takes passion. For you to be able to succeed in this industry that's the truth so but passion keeps me going more and for they say for like all comments is that what the person said okay for someone who is um thinking of venturing into movies or maybe you've always always wanted to be an actor or an actress i'll just tell you be sure it's what you want be very very sure it's not easy you see the glitz and glam like you love it oh they're actresses you watch them on tv believe you me it is not easy my sister can attest today is today is sunday mm -hmm. i went to work on friday by like 10 in the morning was it 10 i did 9 in the morning and i you came out to... before she left before i woke up now yeah and then i came back by 7 a.m in the morning I mean, I said I woke up by like seven. I like I came back from home by like seven a.m. in the morning. It's not like maybe I went to sleep somewhere. We're filming. Do you understand? Right. Uh -huh. So you need to be sure because the way you see it is not really how it is. There's a whole lot in it, and you know it's Nollywood. We don't receive big money like the Hollywood stars do. So at the end of the day, it's just the passion that's really going to drive you. So be sure it's what you want, and I don't think you feel as much as. Maybe you heard that I don't like you to say it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Someone is asking, mm -hmm. what course did you study and what class did you come out to? Uh, I studied agricultural economics and I came out to it a second class lower. I think, yeah, a second class lower. Yeah. I don't know. Second class lower! See, <laughs> the truth is, eh, it's the grace of God that made me graduate from that school. Because. <laughs> I think I was, I was carried away, not not carried away per se. I was more interested in going to do movies than That's I was interested in school. Yeah, that was what happened, and that was in my the result that affected my my final year results was my three hundred level. I think I had like six carryovers in three hundred level because I was not even interested in what they were doing. But they were teaching in class. My mind is Fim. somewhere else. Fim. Or maybe I would have even gone out. But then at the point, I was like, okay, let me just calm down, get this one right, and then move over to the next one. We, we need the, the documents. So, what doc yeah, we need the, the papers. The yeah. papers, yes. yeah, as the, a graduate. Yes, so I had to drop the movie, and then I faced school. Spoiler. Okay, this person asking, beautiful Sonia, uh -huh. how do you always feel acting movies with your younger sister, Chine? Uh, how do I feel? I don't feel any way. I it's, just, it's movie. I just see her as a fellow actress on set, and that's it. When we're done with work, we can just go home and then we can do home home thing. But when we're out filming, it's business of So that's what it is. Someone is asking, mm. what's your bad habits? <laughs> Should I call it a bad habit? Um. One is, I might never say how I feel about the thing. That's one. So yes, that's me not saying my okay, like how I feel about the thing. 
Like I can be angry about something and I will never talk about it. Then being secretive, is it a bad habit? Yes. It is. I'm very secretive, though, guys. Very, very. But no, is that let me not say secretive now, but like I I say which I'm secretive. I'm if I'm being secretive, I don't be secretive to you. Do, do that thing. <laughs> and then I think um I'm not a very social person. I don't know if that's a bad habit. Okay, yeah, it's for my profession, bad. I think it's not so good because at the point you just need to socialize and like mingle with people just for work yeah sake. for work's sake but i don't do it yeah I, mean, I think it's not so cool but it's not really a bad habit let me tell you a bad habit since you don't want to tell it um, she will be in the house for like three days and she'll be sleeping it's not a bad habit let's go out do you know that you tell sonia let's go out never ever ever <laughs> yeah, but the thing is that Sometimes I just feel like, what am I, what exactly am I going outside to do? Like, I can always stay inside the house, there's TV to watch, movie. There's just something to do in the house, there's books to read, and I cannot, I have this ones to deal with, so is it not enough? I have a job, I have actually, I have to know to deal with, is that not enough work already? And then, I'm not going to go outside and meet a whole lot of people with their own trouble. So I'd rather just be in the house. The fridge cannot tell me anything. Or oh, the microwave will tell me anything. Okay. That's it. <laughs> okay, this person. Ah. <clears throat> this person is asking. Uh, please, is Sonia Uche TV on YouTube yours? Uh, whoever asked this question. Thank, thank you. you. First and foremost, I think um I have to go to, I don't know. Is it um is it um facebook so let me use this medium sorry okay. let me use this medium to like talk about this thing i have a facebook page and the name of that facebook page is sonia uche official sonia space uche space official and the username is 125 sonia that is my only facebook page okay now for for like for some time i've i noticed that there's other sonia uche pages on facebook and then i took note of this particular person i, I don't know the exact facebook page that person is using but i noticed that on on youtube there is sonia uche tv i don't know who that person is sincerely i don't know who that person is the person tends to take like videos from your Instagram, from my Instagram, from my mom's Instagram, any video that has to do with me or my siblings. The person takes it from Instagram and the person will post it on that Sonia Uche TV, but it's not me. And also, I noticed that the person has a Telegram. I don't have a Telegram. If I have a Telegram, I'm going to announce it. I'll, I'll post it. Like when you go to my bow on, on, Instagram. on Instagram, you will see it there. Because if you go to my bio, Sonia underscore Uchi on Instagram, you will see my Facebook. If you click that, take it directly to my Facebook page. But this person has an Instagram. I don't. I think the person probably has an Instagram page, but I don't know about that. The person has YouTube. The and person has YouTube. Facebook, and I think the person has a TikTok. Mm, the same person has. TikTok. Yeah, I think so. But the thing is that on TikTok, I have more followers. All the accounts, all the fake accounts, I have more followers than all of them on TikTok. But on Facebook. I don't and then on Instagram I do so please guys this is like a media my mom has a, a YouTube channel Sonia Uche movies Sonia Uche movies but that fake that's um Sonia Uche on TV on YouTube on YouTube I don't have anything to do with it at all also if you're if you're if you're buying hair on telegram it's not me at all it is not me that's the same thing that happened to my friend's mom. So please, guys, Sonia Uche TV is not mine. I don't have anything to do with it. Please, please, if you're watching this video. Besides, if you're if you're buying anything from any vendor, and the person is telling you send money, send money, and the person okay, it's time to send an account. The person is giving you another name mm. of account. Do you know? I think I don't know, but I think some of them do open accounts with the real name. I don't know. Please, if mm. you've been scammed from that Sonia Uche TV, just 
just drop a message yeah in this video yes so that we'll look into it into maybe it. from the account number or the account name we'll we can, look into yeah we can be able because to see if anything can be it's, done it's getting out of hand seriously they're they already dealing with the fact that okay people are using their faces and their pictures to post and grow instagram and facebook, facebook pages just to scam but people the one that you come and start saying that you're selling hair mm -mm, please. please please if it's not mm. sonia that you're chatting with mm. In short, now says that requesting for video call. Yes, and then if you're requesting for video call, if the person agrees to do a video call with you, make sure you stay on that video up to like three minutes. Because that's what now they do. Yes, because now they can take my face. That's how they do this. They can just do that video for like seconds. If it's a seconds video, do not pay. If you're on that, if you want to really make a video with the person and the person agrees, make sure the person stays on that video up to three or five minutes so you can be sure. I don't know if they devised another news for like five minutes. I don't know, but please, guys, if you're not ordering hair from my um, Sonia Hair Extensions page on oh. Facebook, no, on Instagram, Instagram, if you come to my page on Instagram, you can see the business name there. You to take you directly there. You can order your hair there. Even WhatsApp. Yes, the, the WhatsApp, business number WhatsApp number is, is on there. The page. If you just click there to take you directly, please and please don't order hair on Telegram. I beg you, just so you don't lose your money. Please. Okay, this person is asking, mm -hmm. Sonia, mm -hmm. do you have a boyfriend? I don't have a boyfriend. I don't have a boyfriend. Oh. Okay. Um, which of your sisters disturbs you the most? It's China and China. Too much. China is a... If they see this video, they will never agree. <laughs> I tell you. Mr. you can attest to that. Now, China and China, which one can sit down here from one to nine? She's not worrying, but China and China is not possible. Okay. This person is asking, are mm -hmm. you are you single or married? I'm single. <laughs> when are you getting married? Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I when I get a husband, I'll get married, guys. Ah. Okay, this person is asking, is it some... Seventy-five years later. What do you think about long distance relationship? Is that it? Hmm? Yeah, I said. Okay, I think I saw that question. What you, is it? Mm. Is no. Yes, I saw it. I just said. It said. Okay. It said. Are you dating? Okay, okay. Yes, okay. Are you single? Um, are you dating right now? What do you think about long distance relationship? Distance relationship. Is this something I can do? Well, I used to think it's something I can do. Mm? Until. I tried and it didn't work so right now i don't think it's i don't know the truth is people are different do you understand so it didn't work with the first person doesn't really mean it won't work with the yeah. second person but it will really take a lot for me to consider it again because i considered it once and the first one wasn't so good so i don't know if it's something I really want to try, but I think maybe at the end of the day, it might just depend on the individual. But for now, it's just something I want to try. Okay. Mm -hmm. This person is asking, you oh, how do you maintain your shape? You got a beautiful, sorry, I skipped the very, you got a very beautiful stature. Mm -hmm. Tell us. <laughs> okay, how do I uh, maintain my shape? First and foremost, I exercise and I diet. Don't eat. Hmm? Don't eat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I diet and sometimes I don't eat. Like now I've lost weight. Like movies, stuff, stress and all of that. I've lost weight. And then for my top, if I tell you that you're asking the question, it's not you that be giving me. It's not you that said that should be doing Zobo. Zobo stuff ahead. So truth yeah. is that I try to eat um I think things that don't really make me get too big or too thin. So I just do. But I diet and I exercise a lot. A lot. A lot. Yeah. Who's your role model? Asked by somebody. Genevieve Naji. I love that lady so much. Tete. I'm surprised by asking this kind of question. Like, <laughs> if you are following her, or if you, you were following her, still following her on Instagram, yeah. you would have known. Yeah, no, Genevieve Naji is the role model. Okay, this person is asking Would you want to work on movie projects outside Nigeria? Of course. Mm -hmm. Why not? 
I'm open to work anywhere, even in your village. I'm come. <laughs> Is it not film? I don't want to live. Film? I will go anywhere because of film. We want abroad <laughs> because I'm coming as happy. In. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going anywhere. Okay, Somebody's see. asking mm. if your house was burning down and your entire family mm. was sure to be okay. Why you see? I, I, I don't really understand Let me see. the question. If your house was burning down on it and your entire family was sure to be okay, what's really. And your what would you say? Like, like you want like if my house is burning down and I have to save some. No more. We have to save ourselves first before everything. Like, if we can always. If we can come back to that, I think any other thing can be fixed. Life first before any other thing else. Mr. Beggar, what's the material piece? Hey. I always so, guess these things. Ah, this person is asking, mm -hmm. have you ever considered of being in Big Brother Ninja? That's <laughs> okay. I think in the year 2019, I tried, I went for a Big Brother audition. Mm -hmm. This one, like I said, nice. This one always follow me. Hello, follow. Hey, Jama, follow, follow. This girl followed me in this life. Anywhere I go to, she'll follow me. So the thing is, <laughs> then we went now in um, Benin. Yeah. And then that is I felt I I just like God, why did I come here? Because when we're going is like everybody knew me. her. So I'm like, oh, what am I now doing here? So I just did and thank God I didn't go because God knows they'll just kick me out of that place because me and like the most boring person. This girl cannot go for a big she can't even stay in the house for two See, days. I will stay in the house. I'm so boring. They will chase me out of the house. So yeah, then I considered it, but now nah, I said maybe they want to do celebrity big brother, then I can go but Mm -hmm. This person is asking, how do you overcome most challenges in life? Uh, challenges. Before I can think too much, beat myself and all of that. But now I just leave it in the hands of God. That's just what I do now. I don't stress too much over things, especially things that are not like that are out of my control. If it's maybe. I don't stress, I just leave it in the hands of God, like let him just stick and deal with it in whichever way. Mm, you know, this question seems mm. similar, it's, but I'm still going to ask. Okay. I really love your personality and I'm asking, what inspires you? Hmm. What really inspires you? Inspires you? Tell. Truth is, um, there's a whole lot of things that inspire me. First and foremost, mom is a huge inspiration. Like when it comes to personality, I like think, yeah. No, but thinking about it right now, yeah. Because as a person, there are some things you can look at now. I feel like, uh, I don't really like this part of this person's life. And then there's some part of the person's life that you just like, draw inspiration. yes, you draw inspiration from. Like mommy, me, as a person, just like my sisters say, I don't like to socialize. I don't like to go out. But if you really look at mommies, even like right now that mommy stay going now. out before now, she didn't like it. And then um I'm someone from a very young age, I was not someone that people believed so much in. So I just needed on my own to do better and to live better. So I don't know that word inspiration. I don't I don't really know what's up with that, what inspires you. Like, but I draw my inspiration from a whole lot of things. I draw my inspiration from just people and their own life experiences. I draw from my immediate family and from people I look up to, so to say. I don't know if that answers that question. question. Mm. It does. Mm. When I ask, she don't answer. That is the major thing. Okay, this person is asking when you're not in a good mood and you, you go out and people want to take pictures with you, how do you handle it? What do I do? You're not the person that puts me in the bad mood now, so why rely on this shit on you? Aww. I just smile. I just smile and then take a picture. <laughs> I just, just smile and take the picture and then I move. You're not the you're not the cause of my problem now, so what's up? Okay, oh, this person is asking, why don't you want to join your sisters in Lagos? Ask her. Lagos is too rowdy. Ah, Sonia does not like Lagos. Though. Lagos is too, <laughs> it's too rowdy, it's too noisy. 
I don't deal so well with a noisy place and the traffic is frustrating. That's the thing. So I can't I can't do it well. But I can always come around, see, visit, walk, and then go back to my zone. That's all for life. ASB. <laughs> Lagos. Lagos. Maybe some other time we can just Lagos run. Shams. <laughs> Get <laughs> in here. <laughs> I beg Lagos and the feet. Okay. This is second to the last question. Okay. Tell us about your worst incident so far when you really felt like giving up. Um, I didn't feel like giving up per se. Okay, like a movie, let, let me say a movie, mm -hmm. there was a movie I did, Labor of Love, yeah, Labor of Love, this year, young girl was still with me. I don't, see, growing up, each was one person, like, anywhere <gasps> I am, you will find the Joma there. She will look for me anywhere, I'm seriously, anywhere in this. Then, Seth, eh, like my boyfriend then, he Joma, if I lie I down. I don't blame you. <laughs> seriously, <laughs> if I lie down here, eh, he Joma will lie down here. That's how it was. It was like like my child. Anywhere I'm going to, she follows me to so my down to my school. Like go, I, I can I can see how many places I've been to that I've not gone before. So that's it. Like um, back to the question. Then there was this that movie Labor of Love. Mm. Like that was like the beginning of the whole movie thing. I didn't. It was I, I wasn't doing it well because then I wasn't so strong with the acting thing and. Then my mom said a whole lot of things to me, like I wasn't acting well. That the people that are acting with me are saying that I'm a bad actor. That's just because my mom gave me the role. That's why, like, it's because my mom is a producer. That that's why she's giving me this kind of role. That normally I shouldn't play this role. So, and then it was a very bad. Ah, I cried though. I came back home. I was she crying. Cry. Then at location, when I was crying, Mister Mama was crying with me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it was a bad experience. And then I think the worst experience for me so far in life was. Um, I think the year 2011 i never forget that date i think that's like like i felt like the whole world was crashing and i think that's like that was like when i felt like the world was coming to an end like the world was like that's like the end that was in the year yeah 20 i think night night of may yeah there are you remember the date yes i remember the date night of may 29 2011 that like was the worst experience of my life. But so far, God came through and we're bouncing. Do you even know that they were asking what happened in that night? No, of please, me? let's not talk about it. Just leave it. You just ask, like, what was my worst experience? And then that's it. But then, that's fine. Please, you push not disturb me, yo. <laughs> I don't know. Now, wait till they tell us for yeah, Be safe, I know. Please. Yeah. Okay, the last but not the least. Mm -hmm. Please discuss your last experience on location in a move in a film. Okay, see that day, if I didn't know what to do, let's no. move forward. Discuss your last, last yeah, yeah, yeah. What's okay. my last experience? This, um, I, I came on set and there was this lady, I greeted her, and then she said, So the sound guy came to me, he said that there's someone who wants to take a picture with me. I said okay no problem i'm coming let me finish the scene i was filming and he said okay so after all said and done she said she wanted a video and not a picture i said let's make a video i'm like okay no problem let's make a video and then she took me to the balcony to make the video and then after making the video she's like give me your phone number and i'm like i can't give you my phone number she's like no and the truth is that me, I'm scared of heights. And we're by the balcony, and that's like from that place there, that's where you see that big water. Mm. That's mm. this thing. And then this lady was practically dragging me, like, come, no, come, come, come. She's so me, I'm like, hey. <laughs> like I didn't I couldn't shout, but then I'm like, stop dragging me. I can't give you my phone number. And then she kept dragging me. It was so annoying at the same time. I was just smiling because what can I do? So but, that was very awkward. Like, for you. Just, it was very, very awkward. I was just trying to run, like let me just. I, I was able to hold it, I just ran. Just that, <laughs> bro, it wasn't so cool. Like I swear, it not wasn't. Now. No, it wasn't so it's cool. Not like, nice. Tom, Tom. That's not nice. Not nice. Like, if it's voice, please don't drive me like that in public. Can I beg you? Ah, yeah. Yeah, like very scared of heights. Mm. But I shall understand it. Like, what can we do? It's what we signed up for now. 
Hell. See. Finally, we've done this. Please, oh, make sure you subscribe if you've not subscribed. Mm. You people ask for Sonia. I gave you Sonia. Me now, nah, it's my turn to ask. If you've not subscribed, hurry now. Nah, go and subscribe. See. Rush. Hurry. Rush. Rush. Because you don't know who I'll be bringing in next. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> Anyways, guys, if you if you enjoyed this video, please do not forget to drop a comment. Do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to like my videos, and do not forget to hit the bell button. Let me tell you why you should hit the bell button. Whenever we upload any video, and you're not online, you know that you get notified, and it's just be staying on that your notification spots till you watch the videos. Yes. So don't so that you not tell me, oh my, uh, you posted today, we do not know. Please hit the bell button. Please, my my baby girl. Do you have anything to say? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. See, so far so good. I've been seeing the support you've been giving to my Aww. immediate younger sister, and I really appreciate. It. Please keep supporting her. Thank keep you. telling your family members, your friends, your in short, everybody you know. Just tell them about Pretty Oma's word. Okay. Mm -hmm. Please just make sure you tell them about Pretty Oma's word, and make sure they subscribe. They put the notification bell on just so that whenever any video is on, she, you will get the notification and you can watch. And don't forget to always drop a comment. It's very important. Very important. We need to know how you feel. Like, we need to know what you want. Just like she was seeing a whole lot of, oh, bring Sonia, bring Sonia, bring Sonia. And now Sonia is here. So, you don't know what you would request for that would just be here. So, just go ahead and do it, okay? Mm -hmm. See you some other time. Thank you. And, and peace.